back to the cradle and welcome if you are new here today i'm going to be doing an outing with this big old chunky monkey pickle uh is the name of this sculpt by nikki johnson i named her little miss jillian or jilly bean is her nickname she's wearing this cute little summer outfit and i just want to take her out so bad in it before the fall gets here and we are going to go shopping at several stores to look for some fall clothes for babies I also have a bunch of babies coming to my personal collection, so stay tuned for some box openings. Smash that subscribe button if you haven't already and click that bell to be notified for all these new videos. Also, this sweet little baby was just born. This is the Callaway kit, but I am calling him Baby Callan for short. How sweet is this little face? He is gonna be available on my website, kidscradlesnursery.com. I'm gonna list it down below. If you are interested in a sweet little snuggle baby, go check him out on my website and get this little baby for your own collection. Check out this little me outfit. How adorable is this? I love that this kit has a little bent leg, so when you hold him and you wrap your hand around his thigh, his little leg over here straightens out just slightly bent makes him so nice and cuddly for holding this is a cute little snuggle baby he is so great um i've been cuddling him i'm not gonna lie he is great for cuddling so good for chest to chest has so many details look at those little nails anyway it's not about this baby we're gonna go on an outing with little miss pickle i'm gonna go get the stroller ready and let's go have some fun first outing with a toddler baby look at this big huge girl this one is for you tori special request from my bestie um i am at bell's outlets and i'm gonna go in this store with a baby for the first time and see what I can find here. I'm hoping I can find some really good deals. There we go. And she has her sweet little baby with her. How cute is she in her little sun hat? It is bright out today. Holy cow. So I'm just going to be doing a little voiceover since they were playing music oh so loud in the store and I don't want to get dinged, but isn't this blanket so stinking cute? I really needed that little poo blanket and I was able to find a lot of little me stuff in this store, which is super cool because I can never find that stuff. Also, I was kind of looking in this section for some baby shower gifts for people in my family. We are expecting two real babies in our family, so thought I would check out some of these cute toys, especially for Halloween. How adorable is this little teether book? And it's also by Little Me. Great prices. I thought this was so adorable. I am looking for little lovies, but that was like bibs and a little rattle and little miss Jillian is looking so cute I want to show her off because she is so big and chunky and I'm feeling comfortable now in my outings so thought I would go ahead and look around I am trying to find fall stuff but I'm also looking for stuff for little baby boys in newborn size isn't this three-piece outfit so cute and look at the price only $6.99 I did find a ton of fall stuff here at Bell's guys I know not everybody has a Bell's outlet but if you do go check them out because there was a ton of stuff for Halloween for Thanksgiving and just for the fall in general for all of the babies I've never seen so much of a selection in one store I didn't even know what to pick. There were so many cute little outfits and a lot of them came as like two and three piece sets and they were totally worth the price. Like most of them were $6.99 or under $10. So I am seeing a lot of clothes that are in her size and she does need some cute fall stuff. Look at this adorable outfit. I was so tempted to get this one. I have one for Little Miss Sassy Pants for Christmas already and thought she could really use a cute one like this for Halloween, but some of these were like 
and Sassy does have a whole huge wardrobe. So I decided to look on this rack for some stuff for my little Jillian. She does not have a big wardrobe and she definitely doesn't have anything for the holidays. Stay tuned to the end of this video, you guys. I'm gonna do a huge haul because I ended up picking out so much cute stuff at this store because the prices were just too good to pass up. And I just kept finding super cute stuff and really great deals. Now, if you know me, you know my favorite flower is sunflowers and this was so sweet, but I just don't feel like this is her color and I don't really have a baby right now in my collection that goes well with these colors, but oh my goodness, some of these outfits were just too hard to choose from. I feel like I'm going crazy on my babies for the fall this year and I've really been feeling the fall vibes you guys. So I originally was supposed to come here and look for boy clothes in newborn and zero to three months and I did find a couple of cute things so stay tuned for the haul at the end and see what I got for the boys. I am expecting a lot of babies coming to my collection this year, so I really have to stick to what I originally came here for, but of course I can't pass up all this cute Halloween and fall stuff that's out. Even the decorations for my house, I would love to have some of this cute stuff. I'm just not ready to put out my decorations in my house. I already have a couple of things in the kitchen, but... Um, I'm just not ready to full on decorate yet. It is only the beginning of September and I want to just take it easy before I go jumping into Halloween and the holidays. So I have a couple of things out that make me happy, but, um, they did have some really cute stuff at the end of this aisle that I was eyeing for a friend. She loves Hello Kitty and I just got her a Hello Kitty Halloween outfit. MJ, if you have a Bells near you, because I know you live near me, go there. Look at this stuff here. back with little miss jillian with a haul from bells so i actually ended up not getting the things that i needed to find there i ended up getting a lot of stuff for this little girl but to my surprise i actually found a blanket that i didn't even know existed look at this sweet little um plushy winnie the pooh blanket this goes with so many winnie the pooh uh, clothes that I have for the babies. I have clothes in every size. If you've been watching me for a long time, you know I love Tigger and Classic Poo. Um, I love the two of them, preferably together, so I wish there were some little Tiggers on here because Tigger is actually my favorite, but the color of this blanket and how soft it is, oh my goodness, this will go with so many, so many clothes for the babies. So I'm so excited for this. I didn't even know that existed and I am super excited for that. <laughs> so I really, don't you love it when you go to a store and you find stuff that you don't even know you needed? <laughs> so I did find some cute little outfits for little Miss Jilly Bean. I had her with me, so how could I resist? These are 12 month size, but once you wash them, they will shrink a little bit. She wears nine to 12 month clothes anyway, just because of her chunkiness and size. But it says the prettiest pumpkin in the patch. These colors will look so good on her. I cannot wait to dress her in these. Here's another little cute pumpkin, like pajama outfit. Are these not the sweetest? I cannot wait to put these on her. Um, these will be so cute for like October. I'll probably put this little pumpkin one on her in October and um, this one in November. <laughs> these are gonna be so sweet for her this fall. 
I also found another little outfit that I could use for photos for baby boys. This is zero to three months and it will fit my little baby Jace as well. I thought these were super cute colors. I know we're going into fall, but I couldn't resist the price. I don't have anything in this color. And this will actually be really cute for like St. Patty's Day, I think, and it's good for the spring, so why not? And then I found this cute teddy bear outfit. Oh my word, how can you pass up this little three-piece set? I couldn't pass this up. It's very um, like fall colors and the pants are so soft. Can you guys see how soft these little pants are? They almost feel, oh, they feel like a little teddy bear. I don't even know how to explain. It's not even velvet. It's just like, almost like minky. Do you know what a minky blanket feels like? That's what it feels like. Like how cuddly and snuggly will this be? I have new babies coming. I have new baby boys joining my collection and baby girls. So I think this will be so cute for my babies, but also I think this would be so sweet for photos too. And I'm kind of loving like the gender neutral colors. I can put this on a little girl, but like do a little headband um, for the baby girls. I don't know, this was just super sweet. I had to get it. So small haul. So short story with this little outing with this little girl, there was only one person that came up to me in the store and it was at checkout and she asked me how old my baby was. Now this baby was sticking out of the stroller quite a bit. I didn't think I could pull it off. So I was just honest and I told her it was a doll and she actually was an older lady. She looked like she was in her like late sixties, maybe early seventies, super sweet and nice. Her reaction was just amazing i wish i could have videotaped it um but i was she was asking me so many questions like she was so in shock that it was a doll how did you do that how did you paint that what is she made of can i touch her what does she feel like does she have hair how did you get the hair there like she had so many questions i just gave her my card with my social media on it told her to go check me out so she could have all of her questions answered because i could not answer in line and i was being called to the front like i was next so i had to go to the register but i gave her my card it was a priceless reaction and it made me feel so good to know that even though i told her it was a doll she was actually like really surprised she was like in shock and she was really interested in the doll so i thought that was a great reaction for my first time telling somebody it was a doll she was super stoked about it really really like just made my day it made me smile i had so many fears about that and it has like put all that to rest. So, so nice <laughs> for that reaction. I just wanna thank that lady so much if she ends up watching this video. Thank you guys so, so much for watching Little Miss Chunky Monkeys. First time out with Little Miss Jillian and her little baby got to come too, how about that? So I hope you all enjoyed. I'll see you on the next video. Bye guys.